Yeah, yeah. So it wasn't just overnight because we don't see the hard work. A lot of us do not see what goes on behind the scenes. We didn't see uh, Umam Kize that was getting those contracts and not even getting paid for for them. We didn't see Umam Kize doing our marketing schemes. A lot of uh, South Africa was introduced to your lifestyle through your reality show. What inspired Umam Kize, the reality show? Uh, the reality show was merely about finding myself at Tenjiwe. You know, sometimes in life, uh, we as women, we want to impress and we want to be the people that our partners want us to be. And we sometimes lose ourselves in a process. You know, for me, I was this person that my partner wanted me to be. And uh, okay, when I was growing up, I was this person my parents wanted me to be. And then I got married at a very young age and tender age. And then when I got married, I become this person my partner wanted me to be. And in a process, I think I've lost myself. So I said, <coughs> the show will help me in my journey of finding myself. Because when I lost myself, I felt like, no, 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 no. I need to find myself. When I look myself in the mirror, I ask myself, who is this person? And this was not who I am. And for me, the reality show, it was just about finding myself and gaining my identity. And I think I've managed to do that. Funny enough, whilst I was doing that, I've managed to inspire a lot of people. And uh, I've motivated a lot of people, which came up as a surprise to me, Tenji, honestly. You, you are truly and a motivation. You are truly a motivation. Uh, let me, I just want to show your house. Ow. <laughs> Look at this, guys. Black girl is possible. Black girl is possible. Did you grow up in money? Did you grow up in the suburbs? Did, what, what made you have these big dreams? Because a lot of us grow up with no role models. We, we, we grow up surrounded by wrong, wrong role models. Uh, we grew up in the township. The only people who have things that we desire are either Amasela or Idoms Amasela, people who do not know the things. Where did that come from? I think it came from my mom. I, um, you know, I think I'm a mini copy of my mom. Hence, I'm called Flora Junior. You know, there is so much, you know, my mom was, you know, you, she was something else, you know, as much as she was a politician, but she was something else. And I always think that, you know, I looked up to her, but I didn't want to be part of the political part, the part that didn't want to follow the part of her as a politician. I chose to be a business person, but my mom has been my role model. You know, that woman, you know, when I, when I think about her, she, I don't know, she's everything. You know, there was nothing that was shaking that woman. She will enter a room full of men and she'll take control. That was my mom for you. <laughs> Just like you. You say you are not a politician, but I think indirectly you are. Because <laughs> you are that person that we can look up to and say, because given the history of South Africa, there were so many things that we thought were, were, were unreachable for us, especially black women. But you've changed that. You have changed the mindset. And you, you not only you, you own your space and you might not realize, but by especially by doing the reality show, you've made a lot of us uh, fall in love with ourselves and realize that I'm not dreaming too big. My dreams are also uh, valid and they can come true. You, you, you know, Tenji, if I can tell you things that I always tell people that some people, they were very scared of me. They think I'm this girl with nose up, chin up. And I think people they've under, I mean, I've, 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 I think I've got three different characters. There is Ushon, the businesswoman. There is Ushon, the mother. There is Ushon who's got a little child in her. You know, somewhere along the line, I think when I look back, I thought there are some years that I've lost because I, mean, I came up from being a child and I became a wife. I think there's some teenage teenage parts that I've lost in between. So that's why sometimes I will go back and then there will be this child coming out of me. So I've got those three characters in me that are within me. And I think not everybody used to know that. 
before I had my show. But I think people now, they're beginning to connect and interact with me and realize that this is just a simple girl who happens to work hard and manage to achieve whatever that she can achieve, but it has never changed me. Whatever that I have, it, has, it will never change that. I'm just a girl from next door who comes from Mbumbulu, where by Sis Camila <laughs> <laughs> And it's true, you, you, you've never changed. You have never changed.